guys, it's Dylan Lane, and today I'm gonna to be teaching you about the five components of a song. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you do so. I post ukulele tutorials, songwriting tutorials, cover songs, and original songs. Before we get started, I've made you a cheat sheet to go along with this video, and it'll have all of the information written out for you. I'll post a link to that in the description box down below. The definition of the word song is a short group of words put to music with the intention of being sung. If the music is instrumental or without words, it's more commonly referred to as a work, composition, or piece. In this video, I'm going to specifically focus on the five components of a song. So, what are the components of a song? A song is made up of five components. Melody, lyrics, rhythm, harmony, and form. If you're a songwriter, studying and practicing these five components is essential to growing your skill as a songwriter. So let's dig deeper into each one of them. Melody is the part of the song that we hum along to. When we hum, the notes that are coming out of our mouth form the melody. The definition of melody is a single line of notes, sounds, or pitches. If you sing the words rather than hum, you're simply adding lyrics to the melody. A melody is responsible for being memorable, catchy, and pleasing to the listener's ear. Now let's talk about lyrics. Lyrics are the words of a song. You can have a melody without lyrics, but you can't have lyrics without a melody. Even in rap music, where the lyrics are more spoken than they are sung, there's still a pitch attached to each word that's spoken. Even right now as I'm speaking, there's a melody to the words that I'm saying. There's a melody to the words that I'm saying. It's not a very memorable melody, but it is a melody. Lyrics are responsible for telling a story, keeping the listener engaged, and for conveying emotion. Now let's talk about rhythm. Rhythm is measured motion in a song, demonstrated through various note or rest lengths. In every song, there will be various rhythms. The melody you sing has a rhythm, the instrument you're playing has a separate rhythm, and the lyrics will have the same rhythm as the melody since they're combined together. Rhythm is responsible for moving the song forward. Now let's talk about harmony. Harmony is the combination of two or more pitches in a song. While there are often vocal harmonies in a song, I'm referring to the harmonies played by instruments in a song. And not just any instrument, but the instrument that is primarily accompanying the vocalist, such as a ukulele or guitar or piano. So when a ukulele or guitar or piano is playing the chords in a song, it's essentially providing the harmony of the song. A harmony is responsible for setting the foundation of pitches that the melody can be sung over. And last, let's talk about form. Form is the map of your song. The form or map is made up of different sections. And the sections are what we know as verses, bridges, and choruses. The form is responsible for providing structure and organization to a song. Now that you have a better understanding of the five components of a song, you can take that information and apply it to your own songwriting. If you enjoy writing your own music, I encourage you to take time to study each of these components a little bit deeper. If you wish to do that, I'll post some links in the description description box to videos that I've made that break down these components a little bit more. Thank you so much for watching and again I'll post a link in the description box to the cheat sheet for this video that way you can print out all of the information and have it right in front of you. Until next time, goodbye!